Alrighty, I just finished the last of them, so that's 250 trees out today. That was that was not fun, but it's over and I'm gonna worry about it next year. I think we're gonna try and put out. Oh, I guess the grapes are already on order. The next big planting of woody things for us this year is. I think there's about as many. Uh, I think it's 100 or 250 grapes. Uh, I forget exactly how many now. It's, it's been a long day. I've not had anything to eat since breakfast, and uh, it's now like 7, 8 o'clock maybe. I don't know. I haven't looked at the looked at the clock, but I think it's, I think it's going on 7 o'clock. But uh, anyway, yeah, it's done. And once again, uh, yeah, <laughs> be glad this isn't your job. As, uh, whoo, man, this has not been fun. But uh, it's over. Uh, I guess I'll uh, cruise by the house and take some video of... Uh, our trenches that we put in, uh, so, like to you know, kind of decorative uh, around uh, the house, and because um, we've got one pasture that's not very productive, it's oh, it's mostly a, a big ditch uh, that um, you know, it seems like the cows spend too much time over there. So I think we're just gonna fence it off, and you know, let it be trees, and maybe put out a little food plot for the deer to try and attract them up by the house, but. Uh, Actually, while I've been out today, I noticed a couple other places that I think I'm going to put in put in food plots uh, for next fall for the deer. I say, uh, yeah, or uh, I had a deer stand up. Well, actually, I can point it out in that tree right there. Uh, I had a deer stand up in that uh, this year, in our past deer season. I guess it's spring now, but. Uh, I didn't, uh, I saw tons of deer out uh, on the road behind me, uh, but I never did see them when I was in the stand, so hopefully uh, I'm going to put a couple of food plots around here, and uh, actually one kind of sort of at the top of that ridge, and then there's another kind of little secluded spot right in here, and I'm going to put in a uh, food plot for uh, this winter, or well, fall I guess for deer season. And so I'm gonna try and uh, you know see if I can track some deer up here that way, and uh, I may try and pick up a bow uh, like uh, earlier in the season. This cornfield, you saw tons of deer coming off of it before uh, before it got picked, uh, but I uh, you know pick it uh, earlier than that. Uh, you know early bow season kind of starts in beginning of October, and gun season uh, isn't until uh, sort of the middle uh, of November, so by then the corn's picked, so. I may pick up a bow and try and get a deer with a bow. I've never done that before, so should be uh, should be interesting. But uh, yeah, I just uh, put I uh, forget the black last of the black walnuts and shag barks in the woods, uh, just kind of down this ridge here. And so I guess uh, that's pretty much all I can think of to say at the moment. I'm pretty beat, so I'm just gonna turn the camera off, head back to the house, and have dinner.